today, I'm going to show you how to send 200 personalized emails from Gmail in less than two minutes. Hey! And no, I don't mean BCC everyone and hope no one notices. Let's roll. Hey! 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 We're going to do this using Mail Merge, which is a technique where you write one email template and then your software inserts the right data in the right spots and sends everyone their own personalized email. I'm going to demonstrate using an app called GMAS, which is the OG of Gmail Mail Merge. Now, there are other apps out there, but I only have two minutes, so I can't go into all of them. Just trust me, everyone winds up at GMAS eventually. There's like 400,000 users. First up, get your contacts into a Google Sheet. You can start by putting everyone's email addresses in there. Make a column. You can call it email address. And then make another column for every other piece of data you'd like to personalize to them. That can be their first name or their company, whatever you need to really speak to them and write an email that's relevant and meets their urgent needs. Once your Google Sheet is all set, head over to Gmail. Step two, in Gmail. So GMS is actually a Chrome extension, which means it works inside of Gmail. A lot of the other mail merge apps won't do that. They'll work elsewhere, which is another reason why you're probably going to wind up at GMAS eventually for your mail merges. Make sure you have that GMAS Chrome extension installed. Next, click this button to connect your Google Sheet of Contacts to your new campaign. The regular old Gmail Compose window will pop up, but as you see, GMAS has created this list alias email. You don't have to worry about what it is or, or why it's like that. Just know that all of your contacts are in there, and GMAS will send them each their own individual emails. Now, compose your email as normal, but wherever you want to insert your mail merge data, put it inside of left and right curly braces like this. Don't worry about remembering the headers from the first row of your spreadsheet. Just type the left curly brace and GMAS will show you all of the column headers from your Google Sheet. So you can just pick one. You don't have to go back and forth between tabs or anything like that. Step three, click the GMAS button. When everything looks good and you're ready to send, click the red GMAS button to send your campaign. Don't click the usual blue send button or none of this mail merge stuff will work. And after you click that GMAS button, GMAS will send a personalized individual email to every contact in your Google Sheet. So I know what you're thinking. This is really necessary. I mean, BCC's fine, right? No, you're wrong. It's not okay, especially not in a professional context. It is slightly faster, but it's so much less effective. Genuinely personalized emails, ones that feel like one-on-one -on -one real human conversations, get more engagement and drive better results. And GMAS emails look and feel just like one-on-one -on -one messages, unlike BCC, where you're blasting the same generic email to everyone. Plus, you know, people can tell they're being BCC, they see it right there, so they know you're talking to other people, not just them. Plus, GMAS's mail merge is just a tiny bit of what GMAS does right there inside your Gmail account. When you're ready, you can step up to use a ton of the other cool features. Everything from tracking to automation, automated follow-ups, to advanced scheduling, A-B testing, polls, even help with hitting the inbox and avoiding the spam folder. If this video saves you time, gets you better results, or at least saves your sanity a little bit, please consider giving it a like and subscribing to our channel. We've got a ton more videos helping you solve all sorts of email problems. And if you want to give GMAS a spin, you can check out the link in the description, start your free trial, see Mail Merge for yourself. Happy merging.